Welcome to Market Reviews Places. Once again, you find me at the Cedar Hills Food Truck Rally. And this food truck behind me is probably, well, it's definitely some of the best food I've ever had. But it is probably, hands down, the best food truck food I've ever had. So Kitchen 88 is the name of this place. No brick and mortar location. Um, so just the food truck, you're gonna have to go find it. Uh, they started about two years ago, and I, I didn't know what to expect because we ordered pork tenderloin with fingerling potatoes and asparagus from a food truck, right? A food truck should taste more like a cafeteria or something, but this tasted like fine dining, like, like a restaurant. The pork tenderloin was so tender, and it was just flavorful and juicy. It was so good. It was so good, like, one bite, and my wife and I were fighting over it. So, expect to pay $10 for their their meats, their grill items, uh, but it's appropriately priced for what you're getting. A really good portion, and just delicious. Some of the best meat I've had anywhere, anytime. This, this one food truck is kind of changing my perception of food trucks in general. We, we've had a good run here on Mark Reviews the last few weeks, but this one was phenomenal. So whatever you think of food trucks, you know, whatever your opinion or preconceived notions of them are, if you see Kitchen 88, try it. Because this one food truck could give you the, the courage to try other ones that are maybe less appetizing looking. It was excellent. Um, you know, friendly host out in front that took our order on an iPad. It was, it was easy to pay. And then a, a crew that was busy in the back. You know, fingerling potatoes roasted to perfection. Uh, the asparagus was maybe the weak point of, of the overall offering. It wasn't my favorite. A little bit limp, um, a little bitter almost. Generally, I'm not a huge fan of asparagus anyway, but the fingerling potatoes were excellent. Pork tenderloin, incredible. Uh, they were out of the chimichurri sauce, so we just went with a normal barbecue, and it was good. It wasn't overpowering. I'd like to try it with a chimichurri because I feel like that's a better pairing for pork tenderloin. Uh, but if you see Kitchen 88 in the area, make sure to check them out. I will leave a link in the description below to where you can find out more about them. Uh, I will leave a link to their Facebook page. Check them out on Instagram. Follow them around. If they come near you or you see them at a food truck rally, that should outweigh your other choices. I mean, I'm, I'm here with Fatty Tuna again, uh, LOL Hawaiian Grill, which is excellent. I've done a review on LOL Hawaiian Grill before, and Amka Miski Peruvian. Clear winner. Clear winner this week. Highly recommend it. Okay, check it out, and be sure to check out the other videos that we have on this channel, the other reviews that we've done. Subscribe to this channel, like this video, leave me a comment in the section below. Thanks.